Hey guys, it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Galaxy A7 2017 on the left uh, versus the Samsung Galaxy S7. So uh, from the front, you can see that the A7 2017 looks almost like a S7 Plus. Uh, you know, its design is completely based on the S7. Uh, the similarities are quite a lot. So I'm just going to quickly boot both of these two phones up at the same time. And currently, uh, the Galaxy S7 is the champ uh, when it comes to booting up. So let's see if A7 2017 can beat the S7 or not. Here we go. And... Uh, we do have the latest Android 7.0 Nougat official stable uh, firmware running on the Galaxy S7. So it's like fully transformed in its peak performance. And uh, uh, you can uh, install this as well on your S7 or S7 Edge. Just got a wizard sample website. And as you can see, the Galaxy 7 still the champ here in terms of the boot up so i'm just going to quickly increase the brightness on both devices okay it does show you a quick warning with the latest nougat update and wi-fi network on both devices and you can see the similarities between uh, the gray statues ui and the android uh, nougat you know lots of stuff is uh, very much similar uh some things are moved up the, uh, up and down some cool uh, things are added with the Nougat update. So uh, hopefully we'll see the Nougat update on the A7 and you know A 2017 series in general uh, very soon. So uh, everything is closed up in the background connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to go right into the first application which is the phone dialer. And as you can see that was faster on the Galaxy S7. Again you guys are the judge here. Home button response speed is also pretty equal. Uh, let's go and launch settings faster on the Galaxy S7 calculator. Okay, I think that was about the same. Uh, moving on towards some third party stuff. So, first off, we have smash hit and cancel that. The Galaxy S7 just flies through games loading times. And let's we have the Subway Surfer. A little bit different version of the game, but I guess that won't be a big issue because the Galaxy S7 is just so fast. And like I said, it just flies through the loading times. But again, I mean, the price difference between these two phones is, uh, is like about $150, I think. It depends on where you live. So this is like about 500, 520 something, and this is 600 plus uh, dollars. So let's uh, go back into the app drawer and launch Twitter. The S7, Weber, again the Galaxy S7, Sweet Victories, Instagram. And you can see that the A7 uh, 17 faster there. So first victory, I guess, and uh, going into the color switch game. Galaxy S7, tad bit quicker. Uh, Gun Fu, gain the S7 faster. So I'm gonna go right into the camera and see which one can bring that up faster. So here we go. Seems like the S7, uh, I think we should do it one more time. Boom. Yeah, the Galaxy 7 definitely faster. So uh, the S7 overall is faster, uh, no matter how good the mid-range devices are. Uh, the Galaxy 7 will always be at the top of the food chain. I mean, these phones are really fast and this uh, few second difference, you will not gonna be noticing that in real life performance wise. So that's something you need to understand. Uh, but again, we are doing a comparison. That's why, you know, I'm mentioning these uh, differences and that's why it's a big deal because it's a comparison. So I'm going to go right into the browser here on both devices. Time for some browsing action. So first off, we got the wikipedia.org website. Here we go. And let's see which one will be faster. 
Okay, as you can see, the Galaxy A7 2017 finishes up faster here, uh, and the S7 was a bit slow there, uh, but you can see that both phones are looking great, uh, scrolling and everything is uh, super smooth, zooming in and out, no problem whatsoever. So we got Amazon.com. And you can see the A7 2017 already here at the end. Can it finish? The S7 is also here. And yes, it does. So A7 2017 is faster uh, than the S7 at least uh, with these website. And S7 is also done. So uh, I'm just going to go back and test out the RAM management, which is the favorite part of the speed test. First off, we have phone dialer kept in to the memory by both devices. Um, settings. Okay, no refresh. Let's go on calculator. Okay, okay. Looking good. Smash it into the memory. No problems. And... I'm really impressed by the A7 2017 and the A5 2017 because Samsung really improved the RAM management this year with these devices. And that was a big issue with the last year model. So let's go ahead, check out color switch. Perfect, perfect multi-tossing experience on both phones. We have the internet that we just opened and and we are back to the phone dollar. So yeah, uh, top-notch RAM management, but obviously overall the Galaxy S7 is a faster device. Uh, but the difference is in front of you, uh, you can actually save some money. I mean, the A7 2017 is also a pretty fast phone and uh, maybe you don't really need that much faster speed and you can save some money if you you know if you if you go for this one but uh, obviously s7 does provide you a better display better camera and i mean obviously it's a better phone overall but uh, but yeah i just wanted to show you a comparison because some people will buy this phone and that's why they requested this video and you can see the comparison the s7 is a faster device but the a7 2017 is also not that bad not that slow um actually pretty good so i'll be doing another comparison maybe test out camera if you guys are interested in that let me know down below in the comment section and if you have some uh, other suggestions let me know uh, them as well and i'll see you guys later peace